Brothers and sisters of celestial energy, this is Brother Wisdom. You know, myself and Brother Ramon, my buddy, was talking tonight. You know, we were talking about the question came up with Brother Ramon. You know, he he's a he's a very intelligent brother. You know, a young brother, and he's you know finding his way and searching for himself and going to meditation. I really like that. You know, I really like that that brother. You know, I would love to do you know a lot of hands on with, with a lot of people, but you know it's. You know how the thing is right now. You really know how the situation is because, you know, we got a lot of our own people who uh, team up with these orc beings to try to take their own people down for a few measly pieces of paper or for uh, uh, this temporary um, powerless positions that they have created. But Brother Ramon and I, we had a uh, we had a talk. He question came up and said, what is power? Which, very good question, you know, he's, because he asked me, he said, well, he said, well, what are you going to talk about tonight? I said, like, I ain't telling you. I mean, I thought he was going to catch on, but um, he'll catch on when he watches. Um, but the question is, is what is power? What is power? You know, we've been fooled by the system to think that power has to do with money what political position you have, what religious uh, 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 sector you're in, your social status, uh, the shoes or clothes you wear, where you live. You know, we've been duped into thinking that that is power. We've been duped into thinking that guns, you know, if you have a gun and, 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 and you force somebody to do something against what they want to do, you, you've been you told that that's power. That's what the police does. That's what the, this governmental system does. Government mind control. This mind control system does is they try to force people to do things that there's not natural. That's against the laws of nature. If people only knew the balance of universal laws, it says you have the right to resist, you have the right to fight, you have the right to protect yourself under universal laws. Cosmic laws is all about balance. So true power is balance. Okay? Power is balance. And this is why we meditate. To bring ourselves into under in, in balance, to balance ourselves. That's why we meditate. All right. And we and we have become perfectly balanced. All right. Even though we're perfectly imperfect. But when we become perfectly imbalanced, I mean, I'm sorry, when we become perfectly balanced, we are tapping into real power. All right. When you're perfectly balanced, if you look at everything around you. The sun. The sun is balanced. The moon is balanced. Our bodies are balanced. Now, what makes our body out of balance? What makes our body powerless is when we eat the wrong things or consume the wrong things that causes ailments, that causes our body to be out of balance. That's why we got to eat fruits, vegetables, nuts, grains. All right? And when we eat those on a regular basis we're balancing out our body which that energy that we feed our body goes into our soul and our spirit and it feeds our soul and our spirit all together as one balance is 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 something that is equally charged when you have the negative and the positive equally balanced and one is not overbearing on the other one that's power but if one is overbearing the other one that's not power you're out of balance that means you're forcing something that's not supposed to be and for so long on our planet these orc beings have forced us to live against the laws of nature and now nature is taking back you know we was talking earlier today man brother ramon and i was talking and talking earlier you know doing our lunch break and you know um i was telling him about how the planet was out of balance and 
how the mother universe has literally now infiltrated the internet. Remember we talked about the introverse? She's infiltrated the internet. All right? And everything that's out of balance is being brought back into balance. That's why the stock market is falling. That's why, you know, it's, it's, it's collapsing. That's why their system is collapsing. That's why everything that they put their hands on is, is collapsing because Mother Universe is bringing everything back into balance. It's not about money anymore. You know, I, like I told little brother Ramon, I say, I say, hey, you know, the money has no power anymore. The energy that that was on this paper dollar is no more. That's why they're trying to go digital currency to hopefully that they can control something. So he asked, he said, well, are we in the, in the, and are we still in the Pisces age? Said, no, 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 no. We're not in the Pisces age anymore. I said, we're in the Aquarius age, look, bro. I said, but the thing about it is these beings have, are, 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 have brought the residue of the Pisces age into the Aquarius age. And the deeper we get into the Aquarius energy, all right, the more this system is literally destroyed. You know, the deeper we get into the, this, this Aquarius system. All right. So so that Pisces or the residue of the Pisces is literally uh, uh, um, non-essential. All right. It's a non-essential energy. So that's 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 the key point is balance is power. All right. That's 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 balance. So so as Mother Universe is doing her thing and she's bringing balance to the planet. Mother Cosmos is, is charging her up. It's our duty to bring balance to our bodies so that we can also be one with the with, with Mother Universe and Mother Cosmos. All right? We can also be one with them. This is why we talked about that. Your meditation, this is a soulful meditation. Soulful meditation is you you know, uh, being in tune with yourself. When you're in tune with yourself, you got to remember these bodies were given to us by Mother Cosmos, Mother Universe, Mother Nature, all right? Mother Kai, you know, our, these bodies were given to us by them. So when we go into meditation and we meditate and we become in tune with our bodies, we become in tune with everything else around us and within us. Therefore, we are balanced and we being balanced we are now have tapped into that infinite eternal power all right that's what it's all about true power is balance so for this governmental system this mind control system to say that oh well you know we got law enforcement we're going to force you to follow laws that are against universal laws. We're going to force you to follow laws that are against cosmic laws, against planetary laws, against natural laws. We're going to force you. But as long as you remain in balance, that force they use will be used. They, they will end up using against themselves. That's real power. No fear. No feelings, no emotions. You're perfectly balanced. Inner peace, inner balance. That's power. You're not going to let anybody beat you up. That's number one. But at the same time, you're going to use that quantum force because you're perfectly balanced. You're going to use that quantum force. And remember the word quantum means the ability to use less physical force as possible all right so this is where true power comes in where you are perfectly balanced even though we're perfectly imperfect we're always learning but you can be perfectly balanced all right which helps to ensure of your imperfections and make your imperfections uh, uh, more uh, 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 solid into the, the, the line of perf per, uh, per, uh, perfection. So it's important that we understand what real power is. You're balanced. This is why you meditate. 
going to Tai Chi, you know, or your yoga or whatever, when you start doing your chants and 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 uh you listen to the frequencies. Alright? You going into the astral realm and all that. These this is all about balance. That's what real power is. So the key to our efforts in becoming more powerful is becoming more balanced. You want to get rid of your feelings, your emotions. Not saying that you don't want to, you know, you don't want to uh, 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 love or whatever. You know, you, you you want to get rid of these feelings or emotions that 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 are too much. If you have too much of something, then that's taking you out of the, the, the context of who you are. If you're too loving, then you don't have enough energy in you to see the reality of everything around you. If you're too giving, then you can find yourself in a place where you don't know how to receive. You see what I'm saying? So everything has to be balanced. All right. You can't be angry all the time. It's not right to be angry all the time because if you're angry all the time, then you there's no place for you to to actually know when you're in a place of happiness and joyfulness. So everything has to be balanced. That's why I have to say you got to have inner peace, inner balance, and you got to have a perfect a, 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 a perfect anger, which is called rage and fury. Rage and fury is not it's not a it's not an emotion. Rage and fury is an energy. These are energies, and this is all about being balanced. It's all about tapping into that that powerful energy that's within you. And this is when you this is when you go into the higher forces around you, when your lower self and your higher self combined as one. That's balance. When your negative and your positive combine as one, that's balance. When your spirit, your soul, and your body combine as one, that's balance. And that's where power lies. Power lies in the place where balance is. If everything is out of balance, then there is no power, which means that you have to try to force someone. So these beings want to force. They want to use law enforcement. They want to pull out their guns. And then now you're using that perfect quantum force that's within you because you're perfectly balanced. And now you're causing the, the energy that they're putting out towards you to, to for them to turn that energy on each other. And they won't even know why. Because now you've taken over everything. You're in perfect peace, perfect inner peace, and you're balanced, and now you have power over the entire situation, and you walk away unhurt. That's power, which is called balance. Universe is balanced, cosmos is balanced, the sun, the moon, the planet is balanced, everything is balanced, but we're supposed to be in the same balancing energy. All right, guys, just want to pass that on to you. I'll talk to you guys later. All power to the multi-chakra celestial energy beings. Peace to you all.